Taiwan has announced that compulsory military service will be increased from four months to one year for men. The announcement comes amid increasing tensions between Beijing and the self-governing island. President Tsai Ing-wen said that conscripts would undergo more intense training to combat any military aggression from China. It might be Christmas, but there's no festive hiatus in the standoff between Taiwan and China. Following heightened tensions between Beijing and the self-governing territory, Taiwanese President Tsai Ing-wen announced that compulsory military service for men will be extended from four months to a year. She told the country the change was necessary to ensure Taiwan's survival. I have to admit that this is an incredibly difficult decision. But as president, as the commander-in-chief, protecting the national security and ensuring national interest, allowing Taiwan to survive eternally and that the people can live a free and democratic life for generations to come is an unavoidable responsibility of mine as the president. This footage released by Beijing shows China's People's Liberation Army conducting military drills around Taiwan on Christmas Day. Taipei said 71 Air Force jets entered the island's airspace in 24 hours, the largest incursion to date. It follows a year of heightened tensions after U.S. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi visited Taiwan in August. A move seen as provocative by Beijing, which considers Taiwan a breakaway province. All men over 18 will now have to complete a year of service, including eight weeks of basic training, with pay for conscripts also increasing fourfold in what Taipei sees as necessary moves to keep Beijing at bay.